Hello friends, welcome to the help videos of the Simprosis Google Shopping Feed app. In this video, we will see how you can integrate your Pinterest Business Manager account with our app using Pinterest Shopping integration. Let's begin with the prerequisites. Before we get started with the actual integration process, certain criteria need to be met, such as a Pinterest business account and Pinterest ad account, a claimed website in your Pinterest business account, a fully functional and published website that meets Pinterest's merchant guidelines with clear and easy to find pages like about us, contact us, shipping policy, and refund policy. Also, you need to successfully sign up for the verified merchant program. Need to add billing details in your Pinterest business account. Your Pinterest profile should include essential details such as profile name, profile picture, Pinterest username, a completed about section, business type, and target market information. Once the above criteria are met, you should be able to complete the integration with our app for Pinterest shopping. Basically, this integration would allow you to create and submit a product catalog, implement event tracking using the Pinterest tag, and create and or manage a shopping ads campaign. Steps to follow within the Simprosis Google Shopping feed. We begin by logging into Shopify admin, using the store owner account or any other Shopify account with admin level privileges. We need these privilege levels to update the app's permissions successfully. Please click on the apps from the Shopify admin side panel and open the Simprosis Google Shopping Feed app. We are now presented with the integrations page where you need to click on the sign in with Pinterest button from the Pinterest shopping card. It will redirect you to Pinterest.com where you need to grant our app some permissions to manage your Pinterest account. To accept it, click the Give Access button. Please note that if you have not logged into your Pinterest account, you will have to first log in and then grant permission. Thereafter, you will be presented with the page where you need to check your connected Pinterest account and choose the correct Pinterest ad account from the drop-down. If you do not see your desired Pinterest ad account in the drop-down menu, it means you do not have the required admin level privileges to perform any actions. After choosing the correct account, please click on the Confirm Your Account button to proceed further. For the next step, you will be prompted to choose Pinterest Shopping Settings. Here, you will be given options to submit the sale price attributes, along with the product data feed. You can also append the UTM parameters with the product link for better measurement and tracking. You may choose your primary target country and the content language for the product catalog setup. You may now proceed further by clicking on the sync button after selecting the appropriate settings for your store. If your Pinterest business account meets all the requirements for Pinterest shopping, it will be able to create a new product catalog in your Pinterest business account. You will now be able to implement the event tracking for your store using the Pinterest tag. So here, you will be given an option either to choose from any existing Pinterest tag that you have already created, or you can entirely create a new Pinterest tag. We can choose the existing tag to implement the tracking tag for tracking events like page visits, view categories, add to cart, and checkout or purchase events. But, suppose if this existing Pinterest tag is already being used for implementing event tracking for your different online store, then you can also create a new Pinterest tag using the Create New Pinterest Tag button. For our use case, we are selecting the existing Pinterest tag and proceeding ahead by clicking on the Save Pinterest Tag button. The catalog and the tag setup is now complete. If you would like to check out the newly created product catalog in the Pinterest business account, please log into it and navigate to the catalog section. The status can be seen as pending here, as the catalog was recently submitted. Pinterest takes around three days to review and approve the same. Further, to review the Pinterest tags, go to the Conversions option from the Ads dropdown. Here, Select the Tag Manager option from the left panel to view the same. Now, if you just wish to promote your pins organically, you are good to go, and you may end the video here.
To further understand how to create or manage your Pinterest shopping campaign, you can check out another video for which the link is provided in the description below. Hope this helps. If you need any further assistance, please don't hesitate to contact us at support at